Hey Pisces, this is for Pisces singles. I missed you guys with the um, Pisces X reading. <clears throat> I actually did that video, but I was so exhausted that I, I just did not want to put that out. So I'm coming to you guys first with the singles read, okay? Let's see what your options are in love for December 7th through the 13th. Pisces singles, options in love. Pisces. If this reading doesn't resonate, you guys, then I advise you to go ahead and check your moon and rising signs as well, okay? If it still doesn't resonate, um, you're welcome to get a um, personal reading from me by going to pinkarianjam.com. Let's see. I appreciate all of the comments, the likes, subscriptions. You guys haven't already. If you like this video, please subscribe. Hit that like button for me. It helps to circulate the video. All right, guys, one more shuffle. Pisces. Options and love. Hmm. All fire here, Pisces. Um, I see a Leo coming towards you that is very, <laughs> um, this person is very attractive. This person is, is like, I feel like they're, they're a people person. Like they like being out there. They like being seen. They like going out. They're kind of showy. Um, and I think, you know, you're you're at this point where I don't think you really like showy. I don't think you like a lot of attention being drawn to you. And I think you're probably the one that's used to getting, you know, a lot of attention. And so when this person comes towards you, I feel like that's going to mess with you a little bit. That's going to mess with you as far as you know, you have this idea of, if you're a woman, you have this idea of, um, you know, the woman is supposed to get all this attention or, you know, have guys kind of fawning over her. If you're a male, it's like you just don't feel like women should have all of this male attention. And it's going to really mess with you a little bit, but this person is very, very happy um, you guys almost mirror each other. I feel like this person is going to be a challenge for you. That's the thing. This person is going to be a challenge for you because, you know, they are at a point where they're just, they're happy with themselves and they enjoy what they do, but they want to incorporate somebody else into their lives. And that person is you. Okay. I see, yeah, yeah, yeah. That person is you. They really have their sights set on you. They see you as very attractive. They see you as um, very independent, and that's what's attractive to them. They really want to take you out. I think you're going to be fighting it initially, though. I feel like you're not sure about this person is what it is. You're not really sure about this person. I'm going to see what this two of wands and this five of wands is for. Let's see. Why is the two of wands here? Why is Pisces indecisive about this person? It seemed like something flipped. Oh, and it did. The four of swords. I feel like you're just getting out of something. You're healing. You've been through some turbulence in your recent past. And I feel like you're just getting over that, that hump. And really not sure if you want to allow this person into your life. Because I almost feel like 
you think that you know this type of person and you're not so eager to rush into things with this person. You've been hurt before. It's the reason why you've been hurt. And I think that's where, you know, this this conflict, something wants to flip right there. This conflict is coming in um, between the two of you as well as within yourself. Let's see, this five of wands. Yeah, you've been broken hearted. Somebody broke your heart. An Aquarius, possibly. Um, if somebody did not break your heart, then either way, because I was going to say this is somebody that you feel like, you know, has several people or has the option of several people and you don't want to get your heart broken because you have been there before in the past. You've already been through this, so you're not eager to jump into anything with this person. Again, we have Leo here. Um, we have Aries energy, and I feel like you're a cusper with that Aries energy. But we have Virgo, we have Cancer as well, okay? So Pisces for December 7th through the 13th, um, That is, those are the options that you have as far as love is concerned in the upcoming week, okay? I'll be speaking with you guys soon.